Within the last hour, Thai Prime Minister Ying Lok Shinawat has said she will dissolve parliament and hold elections as soon as possible after weeks of increasingly volatile anti-government protests. Our Kwon Zoa has the details. The future of Thailand and its Prime Minister Ying Nak Shinawat are now in the hands of the Thai people. Ying Nak said on Monday she will dissolve parliament and hold an election as soon as possible. This comes after Ying Nak on Sunday proposed holding a referendum amid the intensifying unrest in her country. In a statement beamed across the nation, Ying Nak said she was willing to listen to the protesters and was not addicted to her title as the Prime Minister. If we are still in conflict without finding a solution, I will hold a referendum to determine what the majority of people want. Her offer came as she rejected protesters' demand to form a People's Council last week, saying it was not constitutional. Shinawat says her proposal for a referendum does abide by the constitution. On the same day, Thailand's main opposition party said it would walk out of parliament, saying it can no longer work with what it calls a illegitimate government. To show our firm stance against the illegitimacy of the current parliament, we all, as members of the House of Representatives, are showing our commitment to resign as members of the House of Representatives, effective from today. Without the Democrat Party, the 500-member lower house will be short by around 150 members. Protesters have been on the streets for weeks and have surrounded government offices in Bangkok, calling for the prime minister to step down, accusing her of being a proxy for her exiled brother and former prime minister Thaksin Shinawat. Kwon Soa, Arirang News.